Hey, good morning, Barons. You know what I was thinking this weekend? Uh, and I was listening to this podcast, and they were talking about the biggest enemies of success. And they, they listed three things. So the first one is comfort zone. Did you know 80% of the people don't like change? They like doing the same thing week after week after week. Even if they know the change is gonna benefit them, they would rather stay in that comfort zone. Biggest enemy of success. Second one is uh, learned helplessness. It's where people believe they can't do it for whatever reasons. Uh, and a third is people taking the path of least resistance, taking the easy way out. Um, you, we know that work, uh, hard work, long hard work and failure is a part of being successful. And nothing, we know this, nothing worthwhile can be overly um, achieved easily. So with some to think about, Let's all be successful. Hey, before I, I let you go, you know, uh, this month is Autism Awareness Week. And last week I was a little disturbed because um, somebody, and I think it's just one person, decided to go to our special needs class and, and outside their classroom they had a garden and decided to uh, vandalize it and kick all the plants, throw all the plants away. These, these students have been working on these plants since they were seedlings and they were growing them. And someone took one opportunity Thursday night and destroyed all of them. And you know, I thought about that and I thought about not even mentioning it to give that person credibility, but I think students, staff at Bonita Vista High School share a belief that we can all make this world a better place by just being kind to one another. Maybe if we know who that person is, talk to them and, and set them straight, you know? But um, keep that in mind. This week is, uh, this month is Autism Awareness Week. We should be kind not only to our special needs students, but to everybody out there. With that, make it a great day living the barren way. Have a great day. TEDx was created to provide a forum for people to share their thoughts on relevant topics within our San Diego community and to inspire changes in people's lives. TEDx is composed of departments, stage design, finance, tech, speakers, and PR. All of our officers and through them the rest of the club members collaborate to prepare for our conference in April. This year, our conference will be centered around the theme, Building a Sustainable Future. As such, we will have speakers talking about their experiences with the values of the UN Sustainability Goals, which include human rights, well-being, and environmental awareness. This year is actually really exciting because we're going to be having spoken word poetry instead of only conventional speeches. So, you know, we have normal speeches, normal maybe 7 to 12 minute speeches, um, but then we're also going to have some spoken word poets and so they'd still give around maybe like seven minutes of their speech um, but it consists of poetry and so poetry is one of those really almost humane in a way um, like form of communication I don't know if you've heard but it's there was a study done that they were trying to build robots. People were trying to build robots that would deliver poetry, but in the end, it's never gonna be the same because they don't have that, you know, that emotional capacity to be able to communicate using poetry because of, you know, a lot of really strong language as well as the rhythm that's involved, the tension that poetry provides. And so in including spoken word poetry in our conference this year, we're really celebrating the different ways that people communicate and the different ways that people take in information.